sometimes I don't know where this dirty road is taking me. Sometimes I don't know the reason why, so I guess I'll keep gambling lots of moves and lots of rambling. Well, it's easier than just a waiting around. Get the shrapnel out. Me? I'll keep him still. Trying not to be loud. It's okay, AJ. Just breathe. Put your hands there. Stop the bleeding. It's okay, AJ. He's just gonna pat you off. It's enough. For now. Whoa, whoa. Easy. Easy. I didn't mean to endanger you. The walkers were sent to help you. You sent the walkers? Was part of a group. Call themselves Whisperers. They've learned to live in herds, among walkers. Move among them. Sometimes guide them. Why are you alone? If you were part of a group. They attacked a community. Saw the carnage. Didn't want to be part of it. Oh, does it hurt? Hungry. Eat. Thank you. Do 
Do you have a name? Been a while. Since... I've said it. James. Why did you help us, James? The people who attacked you. What do you know about them? I know they steal kids. They took two last year. A common practice for them. They're at war up north. Their entire community against another. It's why they take people. To make them fight. Train them. Use them. You would join their war. That's horrible. Yes. That's why I helped you. Thank you. Clem? Wait. Throw it. Distract him. Works just as well, and nobody gets hurt. Not us. Not him. Thank you. Safe. It was difficult to send the herd in to save you. I didn't want them to die. So, James, do you just hang around in the woods, saving random people? After I left my group, I wandered. First time alone, ever. Saw war everywhere. First against walkers, then against each other. Hoped it would be better here. Where are you from? Here? Or somewhere far away? I lived in a school nearby. Lived? Well, we're not welcome there anymore. So, where are you from? Washington. The city or the state? The city. Dad ran a food truck. I helped. <sighs> You've got a fever. His wound will need proper cleaning and medicine. If you're lucky enough to have any. The school has medicine, but I don't think they'll share it. That's why those people attacked you, isn't it? To get to that school. They'll destroy whatever they find. Bring more guns, more fighters. Take everyone inside. They won't be able to fight them off. You need medicine. You have to go back. Or you'll lose him. I'll go back. Convince them to help AJ. They'll take us back once they see him. They wouldn't turn AJ away. You hope? I'll help you get back. Past the walkers. A few more hours and we'll go. That's a few hours for you to sleep. I'll stay awake. You don't have to. Sleep. I'll keep watch. 
Mm, I can't. Then we'll both keep watch. Less lonely. True. Is he awake? Yeah. He's so hot. I can carry him. You're exhausted. No. I've got him. You live out there alone, right? You could stay with us. Not ready. I don't see James. Just monsters. <clears throat> James? You're hurt. Did the Raiders do this? It looked like they had people from your school. Why are you here? Those people you saw, we're going to save them. But to do that, we need your help moving some walkers. could maybe help, but my mask is still in the camp, inside my bag. I can't pass through a herd without it. Okay, then let's go get it. Please, I just... I just ask that you don't kill them. The walkers. If you distract them, I can sneak over and find my mask. Distract all of them? Please. I'll... I'll try. I can keep this up. Did you find your mask? I can't find it. The horses must have... There! Oh, shit. We have to run. Hey! Over here! AJ! No! There are too many of them! The cart. If we push it, the noise will draw them away.
Hey, Jay, are you okay? Yeah, no bites. I know it would have been easier to kill them. You're kind. I appreciate it. Really. Thank you for helping me get this back. Now, how will Walker save your friends? They're being held captive on a boat not too far from here. We can't sneak on board without cover, not without the raiders gunning us down. You want to use walkers to hide? To sneak on board their ship? That's insane. It's our only chance. I... I have something I need you to see. So you can understand what you're asking. We still need his help, right? Yeah, we do. It's safe. Just a little further. A wind chime. Might be pretty in our room. Clem, what's this? It's called a salt lake. Salt lake? Ugh, sounds gross. Go ahead, lick it if you want to. <laughs> <coughs> oh, gross! It tastes nasty. <laughs> well, now you know. Ugh, learning sucks. Beatnik. My people, my former people, they had a practice. They called it collecting. them as a weapon. I do this to protect them. I know it sounds strange, but that's why I brought you here. To see them as I do. As people. As people? Well, not people exactly, but <sighs> something in between. Part of us is still in there. Deep down. So few of us die anymore. We turn. Not dead, not alive. Well, you can't prove that, James. Look, I've heard some weird things, but walkers having a soul? Like I said, I know how it sounds. Do you really think there's people inside of monsters? Somewhere, yes. Think about it this way. Has someone you cared about turned? 
Clem's friend, Lee. She let him. Because he was too important to her. Do you really think there's nothing left of who he was? Maybe. I guess it's kind of nice to think that the something that made Lee, Lee, is still out there. Even if it's not the way he was before. I think so, too. I lived among walkers for years. Still do, in a way. When they're alone, they're harmless. Innocent. If you want my help, I need you to try and walk with them. Then tell me if you really believe they're just monsters. They are just monsters. They're not people or friends. Clem. She'll be safe, I promise. I'll be fine, AJ. I'm doing this, okay? Uh, I... <sighs> okay, fine. The first rule is never go alone. I'm not leaving you. I'll be right back. Check the windows. I will. And say fuck off to fear. I will. I promise. The mask will disguise your scent. But be gentle. And be quiet. Touch the wind chime. You'll see. Her kiddo. It's all right. I'm fine. See? No bites. No bites. So, do you still think they're just monsters? Now that you've seen them at peace. I... I think you might be right. About there being something more to them. It was kind of nice in there. Really? Never met someone who understood. It's... Thank you. I'm glad. Have you ever killed a walker before? I have. Many. Have you ever killed a person? Many. But that was a long time ago. 
I've killed someone before, too. AJ. You've killed someone? But I was justified. I see. <sighs> That's enough. What about the walkers? Are you going to help us save our friends? I thought I could, but I can't. So many walkers would die. All of the death this would cause. James, the walker in the barn, the one with the different eyes, what was his name? His name? What do you... How about the woman in the back, near the wind chimes? What's her name? I... I don't know. Asim. Omar. Violet. Those are the names of my friends, the ones who were stolen by the raiders. I'll never forget that. I may be stubborn, but I'm not heartless. Those raiders are cruel. They force others to be the same. And if your friends are anything like you, I don't doubt they're worth saving. It'll take some time to guide them through the forest to the shore. Others will join the herd as they go. Tomorrow night, be ready. I can't undo this. You said there might be people inside walkers. Did you mean it? Is he right? Honestly, I just told him what he wanted to hear. Walkers are just walkers. So you lied? We needed his help to save our friends. So lies can help sometimes. Huh. Come on, AJ. Let's get back. We're really doing this. Only the team blending in with the walkers need to cover themselves. Now we just need your walker friend to... He's here. Good lord. Uh, hello. Guys, this is James. He's my friend. He's, uh, so cool. How do you get the skin like that? Uh, oh. I, um... Clementine? Willie, stay focused. Now isn't the time for this. We can ask questions later. Yeah, right. Sorry. I'm focused. Oh, and... Sorry I tried to shoot you that one time. Your mask looks so real. Functional and fashionable. I'll take two. <laughs> Funny. Is this the guy that Clem said she'd... Flip? <laughs> yeah. Um, Clementine, could I speak to you alone for a moment? Good idea. Hold tight. Hey, uh, Dan, come here, buddy. I gotta tell you something. The walkers. They'll be here in a little while. You can join them as they pass through the trees. The noise from the boat will draw them toward the water. Then we can get on board and save our friends. Your friends are different, open-minded, accepting, like you. That's not usually how my first impressions go. Sorry, I feel like I'm rambling. It's just being welcomed 
bit strange. You know, they could be your friends too. I know you didn't want to come into the school before, but now that you've met them... I haven't lived with people in a long time, but it does sound nice. Let me think about it. I wanted to show you something. This is... was my boyfriend, Charlie. We joined the Whisperers together. But it changed him. In a way that couldn't be undone. It changed both of us. What do you mean? The Whisperers were my family. From a young age. In that time, I witnessed a lot of death and suffering. Eventually, I became the cause of it. Weakness was considered a poison. And I believed in that fiercely. So much so that when another boy expressed sympathy for our enemy before an attack, I slit his throat. I didn't talk to him, didn't consider who he was, what he felt. You killed someone innocent? A child? That's horrible. I know that now, but then I didn't care. It had to be done. After he died, I kept hearing his words in my head. Those people are like us, just on a different path. I stopped killing after that. I changed. No one else did. When AJ told me he killed someone, it reminded me of them. Of myself. When he said it was the right thing to do. Taking life like that, from a young age, it breaks something inside you. It broke something in Charlie. I just... I'm afraid if AJ kills again, he won't be able to go back. He won't be the same boy he was. I've seen it happen too many times. Being ruthless is what's kept him alive. That's all that matters. And if history remains true, it'll be what gets him killed. They're close. Soon there will be enough of them to provide us cover. I'll lead you through the herd until you reach the boat. That's as far as I go. After that, it's up to you. Thank you. Clementine since before this all started. She'll come around. You'll come around too, once you see what we have to offer. Found one more sneaking Plenty of over food, the docks. Comfortable beds for you and Clem. Tin! Fuck. Tennessee, did you get lost? Ma'am! He wasn't alone. I got something else to show you. This way. Found this in the herd. No wonder there were so many walkers. Must have thought you were clever leading those walkers here. Or was that Clementine's idea? Nothing to say. You don't fucking scare me. Is that so? Force your ways onto others. Because you're afraid. Because you're weak. I give my people a cause to fight for. The thing about people like him, AJ, is that they're too broken to fit into a community. They won't fight for anyone but themselves. <laughs> Kill it. No! Fuck! 
Easy there, Ted. Don't hurt him. Just stop hurting people. Please. Shooter! Why don't we all just take a breath, all right? Give me my friends back. Put down the gun. Let them go. All of us. Or, or else. Fine. Go ahead, then. Do it. Save your friends. That's what you came here to do, isn't it? <laughs> oh, I see. You came here to cry. <laughs> Looks like you're not a soldier either. Please, don't! No! through there. We don't know where it goes. Well, we do know there's walkers in the other direction. But... Move it, dummy! I saw his eyes when he did it. I saw the bloodlust in them. What are you talking about? Nothing. Go. In here. We can't move forward without a way to see. I'll figure something out. Hmm. We need some way to. 
to start a fire. Another one. Hmm. Gotta get home before AJ can play with it. Swimming through that. The water's moving fast. Too dark to tell how far it even goes. Start a fire. Look nice in our room. Just have to get home first. Hmm. Perfect. Flint. home before you know it. If I yank that out of there, it would drift down the river and get caught in the rocks. Could work as a bridge. Okay, we just need to go across one by one, and then we'll move the rocks out of the way. And then I'll take...
way do we go? Ten, do you see a light down any of these tunnels? You brought this on yourself. Oh! Clem! But it's not too late. Let go! For him, at least. <laughs> Follow us and I sprain your ankle. Follow us after that, I break your leg. I won't let you take him. I won't let you make him a monster. Not any further. Ouch! You're coming with me. What happened to not wishing anyone harm? It has its limits. You fell. I'll kill you before I leave her. You did this. You made him this way. You had him empty an entire clip into that woman's head. It was only half a clip. Is this what you wanted? A boy who only sees an answer at the end of a barrel. Look at me. And tell me this is what you wanted. She deserved to die, and you know it. By his hand? In that way? I've seen what rage like that can do if it remains unchecked. Believe me, you don't want to see it with him. I like it. I liked killing. It made me feel strong. I don't care if it was murder. I don't care if it was anything. It felt good. Best feeling I've had in a long time. Maybe ever. AJ, you talking like that? It scares me. Never think that again, and certainly never say it again. Does it matter? You can tell he already believes Stay it. Stay out of this, or I swear I'll claw your fucking eyes Neither out. Neither of you are listening. Anyone that wants to hurt us should be dead. And I'm not sorry about it, and I'm not gonna feel bad about it. AJ. I don't know why you're scared, when you've always said for me to be like this. You always said surviving was the most important thing. Be strong. Be brave. If something wants to hurt us, shoot it right in the head. Killing Lily made us safe. There's nothing wrong with liking that. I can't listen to this. You think you can change him? Do it then. Talk to him. I'm not gonna stop, Clem. I I'm not gonna let people that wanna hurt us just... walk around. You can't tell me to stop and expect me to get it. You can't tell me to stop when you know it just confuses me. I know this world is hard. For all of us, and for you especially. But there's more to it than, than just survival. Like what? Rule one, never go alone. The very first rule is about how to survive. But where are the rules that are more important than that? Why aren't they first? And why are you just telling me now? You can't just make up new rules, Clem. It confuses me. The older you get, the more rules you have to learn. Surviving is what you needed to learn first. But life gets more complicated. Everything gets more complicated. And that includes you. Killing Lily wasn't complicated. I need you to hear me, AJ. You can't talk like this about killing anyone. Even Lily. I've heard enough. 
It's obvious you can't teach him. understand who we are. I understand you. I've seen your kind. The world is full of you. I've been you. All you know is violence. Death. He could live a peaceful life, but... But it's like you won't let him! It might seem hard to believe, AJ. I know it does, but listen to me. No one has to die anymore. Not humans. Not walkers! James, this philosophy of yours? This philosophy is what has kept me human! It's what will keep any of us human! It, it takes more than words. You can't just talk people into being peaceful. You think I don't want a life like that for AJ, for myself? God, I'd love to live in a world where I didn't have to worry about killing or dying. But that's just not how things fucking work. Not yet. And what you're doing now isn't going to change that. What is it? He doesn't get it. Not like we do. Not like I do. Let me help you, Clem. Trust me to tell which people are bad. That I won't ever use my gun because I like it. But only to keep our friends safe. Please, you can trust me to decide when it's right. Okay. Really? You're growing up too fast, AJ, and that, that scares me. But you've seen things and done things no one your age should have to do. You've earned my trust. If you say you won't ever enjoy killing, I believe you. I won't. I promise. Feel that? Yeah, that's the way out. Go. I'll make sure you won't be followed. Thank you. Be safe. <laughs> 